The blockchain revolution is coming. The blockchain technology is gonna change how we do everything, from buying anything online, buying properties, or just about anything that needs accounting for. The question is, which blockchain platform is going to win the race? Welcome back guys, Nathan here, and I'm really excited to share with you something very interesting I learned last week about a blockchain platform called EOS. If you saw my recent market update video, I shared the asset class performance of 2020 so far. So we looked at stocks, bonds, gold, silver, cryptocurrency, and it was crypto that had the best performance so far this year. And I do think it should be part of every smart investor's portfolio. Having said that, one of the best pieces of advice is invest in what you know. I do believe the crypto market has huge growth potential over the coming years. So it's my job to help educate so blockchain and cryptocurrency is something that you do know about. If you find anything in this video useful, please click that like button. Every like does count and it's much appreciated. Okay, sit back and relax. Here is what I discovered last week about the blockchain platform EOS. So here is what we've got coming up. The blockchain revolution is coming. We're going to look at the EOS opportunity and then finish on how to invest in EOS if you choose to do so. Quick disclaimer. This video is for education purposes only. You should seek investment advice from a registered professional before making any investment decision. This video is not responsible for any investment actions taken by its viewers. blockchain. Satoshi Nakamoto, 2008, anonymous person, came up with this way of people transacting, doing business with assets, peer to peer. And trust is not achieved by a middleman. It's achieved by cryptography, by collaboration, and by some clever code. And what that means is that we now have a native digital medium for value. So the choice, when I talk to people, I said, what do you think will be here in 2040, approximately 22 years from now? Will gold still be here? Well, it's been here since eternity. <laughs> will, the dollar, will the dollar be here? Right. I don't think so. And, and will blockchain be here? I think so is going to be a very critical technology for the future development of the world. It's not only about the financial. Blockchain technology is not about Bitcoins. Bitcoin is just a small function of the blockchain technology. I'm a strong believer of the blockchain technology. Bitcoin is either MySpace or it's Facebook, I don't know. But blockchain is social media. So at the macro, blockchain is going nowhere. Right? Like blockchain is here to stay forever. And it's a very big deal. The business world of the future, say 10 years from now, it's going to run on smart contracts, it's going to run on strong encryption and on you know peer-to-peer -peer based consensus mechanisms. So the core technologies underlying blockchain are going to pervade everything just like the internet has, just like object-oriented software has, right? No. So we're going to jump over to a website called CoinMarketCap. And this is pretty much the website you need to know about to keep an eye on all the different cryptocurrencies and all the different blockchains. So it's a super useful website. And on the front page, it's listing the top 100 cryptocurrencies by market cap. In the top left, we've got all the different cryptocurrencies. So there's now 6,748. Shows you the total market cap and the 24 hour volume. And then you can click into each individual one if you wanna see individual charts. But the things I wanna point out here is, you may probably know, but it's Bitcoin that is dominating by far. So you can see the market cap for this is almost 200 billion. It shows you the current price, the volume, um, some trends. Then number two is Ethereum. So this is more of a blockchain network. Um, and again, this is dominating um, the blockchain networks. You've got your stable coin and then your different ones. So EOS is all the way down at number 13 and the market cap is only 2.6 billion. So 2.6 versus Ethereum, which is 44, you can see it's a fraction. And we're now heading over to a website called Blocktivity. And this is the website I was introduced to last week. So I've got some really important things to show you because this website is very, very useful. 
So this time it's showing the top blockchains. So you may or may not believe in cryptocurrency, but you cannot deny blockchain and it's going to be huge. So what it's showing is all the different top blockchains and then all the different processes. So which blockchains are actually being used. So this is super, super useful. And you can see here, the number one blockchain being used right now is EOS. And the different processes that it's doing is 66 million compared to even the second biggest blockchain, which is only doing 4 million. These are per day. And you can see, so where is Bitcoin and Ethereum? So Ethereum's right down at number eight and Bitcoin is right down at number 12. So sometimes this is quite hard to get the information across in a, in a whole bunch of numbers. So let's do it in a picture. And if we scroll down, it will show you the operations being made by the major blockchains. So here is the same thing again, but in a picture. You can see over 80% of all the transactions and activity happening on blockchains right now is happening on the EOS network. However, and this is the this is the whole reason I made this video, guys. The market cap of the major blockchains, so this is where people are investing, it's all in Bitcoin and Ethereum and EOS only has 1% of the money. So this tells me two main things, and this is the purpose of this whole video. Number one, either Bitcoin is extremely overvalued right now, or EOS is extremely undervalued right now. So this could be a big investment opportunity. So for the people that would like to know how to invest, here are a couple of options which I've used myself. The first is an exchange called Coinbase, and Coinbase is just a really trustworthy place where you can buy and sell, and it does have EOS, so you can get EOS from Coinbase. And Coinbase is one of the biggest, most reputable companies. Now, I do have a link in the description of this video where if you use that link, you can get some free Bitcoin just for using that link. The other option that I use, which I prefer to use, is an index fund. So Crypto20 is the world's first tokenized cryptocurrency index fund. And this way, as we don't know which ones are gonna be the winners and the losers, this way, this fund basically buys into the top 20 cryptocurrencies. So you can actually own the top 20 coins. So you will, by default, own Ethereum, Bitcoin, EOS, and all the other ones. And the great thing about the index fund is that you'll only be investing in the winners. So all the winners will flow into the top 20 and all the ones that are not very good will flow out. So an index fund is a great way to invest in cryptocurrency, but you will need to know about exchanges. So these are the different exchanges where you can buy this token from. However, there's gonna be a learning curve if you've never used exchanges before. Let me know if this is something that you'd like to learn as it's a bit too much for this video. So there you are guys, blockchain is a huge industry coming our way. And as you can see, there's something very strange happening right now where EOS is performing 80% of all the activity on blockchains. However, it's only got 1% of the market share. So this either says to me that Bitcoin and Ethereum are extremely overvalued right now, or EOS is extremely undervalued right now. And I just wanted to share this bit of information with you. Either way, the blockchain revolution is coming and it'll be really interesting to see who the Googles and the Amazons, the big winners of this revolution are going to be. So if you found anything in this video useful, be sure to click that like button. Every like does help and it would be much appreciated. If you haven't yet subscribed, be sure to click the subscribe button and join us. I do have some great videos coming up and let me know what do you think about blockchain and EOS. Let me know in the comments below the video. Okay, cheers guys. I'll see you in the next video and it's bye for now.